I told my mother that I really would like to do something with my life to make my future a good one and to have a good life because in the future if something happens to my family my mother and my father pass away then what am I going to do and my mother said okay that's fine what do you choose to do and I said I would like to go to a chef school to learn to be a chef how to present food and all that kind of things and my mother supported me and we started looking and looking for places and schools but a lot of them are not accessible for the deaf and I have to f they only focus on hearing so we need to go back to special schools and luckily we found the NID when I arrived at NID um, 2013 until 2014 I learned about upholstery and 2014 I finished and I went back home I arrived at home and I really hoped I would get work one day so I took my CV and applied a lot of workplaces everything went well and then outside close by my home I found work but I didn't feel comfortable because all of the staff are hearing and it was difficult. They don't know the way of the deaf. But I stayed patient and luckily one day my father told me and he, I, he told my mother as well. Nontle, you were called to Cape Town Worcester and you found work there. And what? I was so happy and I was surprised. And then I went to NID and I started working. I um, started working at NID as a teacher or a facilitator for upholstery. I'm a facilitator assistant until now. And I work very good and very well and my life has improved. And everything has improved in my work. I went back home and I was shocked to receive a message from Tsepo and we started messaging each other and and talking about a relationship and that and he told me that he likes me because I always focus on the important things of life and I understand him so I arranged transport to go to Tsepo's family in Pretoria and the family looked at me and they were happy and they told Tsepo that I'm going to be a good wife and Tsepo just was very thankful and later on we decided to get married I was so shocked and then December 23rd 2017 we got married and we are still together from 2017 until now everything has improved in my life our relationship is good and everything is perfect